now we're pleased to bring you our feature presentation. Hey guys, it's your girl Stephanie. Welcome back to Stephanie the TV Show Girl. And today I'm going to be doing more of a sit down video than a more like usual video than I do. I know, if you hear any noises, it's these little jingle jingle bells. I got them and they're really cool. And I, they're not my little stress toy and I can't remove the Christmas tree thing so I just got to live with it. Like my little jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. Yeah. So today I'm going to be telling you a story about how I got into the band Queen and why I like them and whatnot. And if you guys don't know who Queen is, Queen is a rock band from that started in the 70s. And the band members are Freddie Mercury, John Deacon, Brian May, and Roger Taylor. And, um... All the songs are amazing, except for a couple, and, yeah. So, yes, I'm gonna start. So, it was around the year 2006, and the movie Happy Feet just came out. And me and my, me, my mom and brother went to go see the movie together, because that's what we do. Well, that's what we did at the time. In the early 2000s, we would always go see a new movie movie when it came out and yeah so we went to see happy feet and and the movie was going great although i wasn't really um the type of person to just sit down and watch movies and stuff at the time as a kid because i had a lot of energy so i wanted to run around and play so you know so you know i was just a little bit energetic but I did see the movie. And during the movie, there was like this one scene where the penguins were singing Somebody to Love. And I instantly fell in love with that song. I was singing that song the whole entire car ride home. And surprisingly, um, my mom knew what, what song that was from. And she said it was from the band Queen, and I'm like, Queen? Who are they? Well, at the time, I didn't really know the value of using a computer and stuff. So, I didn't really know how to, like, use a computer and stuff, because I was, like, little. So, yeah. Anyways, so, some part of love with my first Queen song. And then, and then years later, in 2008, I saw the episode of Drake and Josh, The Storm, and I really loved it. It was, like, the best. And there was, like, this one scene where um, Helen was, like, slapping her thigh, and, and she was, like, slapping her thigh and stamping her feet, and then everyone did the same thing, and then... They were just singing We Will Rock You. And that was literally the most amazing scene ever. That was like the best way to end the episode. By just singing We Will Rock You by Queen. I love that song. And yeah. And yeah. I just love We Will Rock You. Then years later. In two, then in 2010. Not years later, to the in 2010, I was on like YouTube because why not? I was on YouTube on my like um on my computer, and I was like watching YouTube, like watching my YouTube videos for kids because I was a kid at the time. But then I stumbled across um a YouTube video by Queen, and I don't know. I correct me if I'm wrong. Queen did like this type of thing, where people people will recreate the famous head banging scene from Wayne's World from like that old '90s movie. And I saw that and it had Bohemian Rhapsody in it, and I actually did the head bang. And 
I just, I just fell in love with Bohemian, and I was just doing the headbang like, the headbang like this, <laughs> the headbang from Wayne's World, and I was doing it, and I just fell in love with Bohemian. So Bohemian Rhapsody was my third, was the third song I listened to by Queen, and then I listened to Under Pressure and Radio Gaga and. And I want it all in Bicycle Race and Fat Bottom Girls and blah, blah, blah. All the other songs that they made. And all of them were good. Well, I want it all is really the best song. And same with, with, same with Bicycle Race and Fat Bottom Girls. And Body Language is the one song that I find that's super weird. And, yeah. Anyways. So, around 2012, I searched up who... Like, well, we were lucky because that was like what I was thinking about at the time, and that was like a question that just popped into my head at the time. So I typed it in on Google, and then um, and then it just popped up at Queen, and I'm like, Queen, who the heck is Queen? So I just um clicked on the the Wikipedia page and I just read all the information and stuff, and I'm like, wow. And at the time, I did not. Um, I didn't, um, have any Queen CDs at the time and stuff, like I have now. I'll show you the two Queen CDs that I have now. I have this, this is the Bohemian Rhapsody soundtrack I got at Target. And I have the Queen Greatest Hits CD that I got for my birthday. So, Yes. So, I've been going back and forth listening to different music. I was listening to kids' music, just a beeper. One Direction was a big thing for me around the year 2013. And I was just listening to all of the songs. And I was listening to all of the, the people that I was listening to. Like, all the music and stuff. And... I still listen to One Direction to this day. I still listen to some kids' music to this day. And I still listen to Queen to this day. And ever since... Um, ever since I found out about Queen, my life just changed. And... I... And... And the reason why I like Queen is because of the awesome music. They're just funny. They just... Are just funny people. I just... I just love all of their music and and the the funny and I love just seeing them perform live. Whenever I watch the live the, the live shows on YouTube, I just love them and they're just like the best. They're like a, they're like they're just like the they're the best band in the world, and I just feel like no other band can compared to that and stuff so yeah sorry I turned around I was just, I'm watching TV so I get distracted by the TV and my bowels so yeah so anyways that's how I got into Queen and stuff like that so yeah I hope you guys really enjoyed this video please give this video a big Thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and click on the notification bell so you do not miss when I make a new video. And yeah, without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! <laughs>